Hello everyone, this is Super Aiden Yu, and welcome back to some more Persona 4 Golden. In the last video, we went into the Davy world, and we also um, saw a little bit of the Midnight Channel and saw a familiar face. Um, this time, we're going to go to bed and continue on with our days. Oh, it's a foggy night. Oh no! Is it that girl? How'd she get up there? Oh, hello! Oh, you're up. Well, I'm off. Oh, bye. See ya. Dad has to go do something. He got a call, so he left. Okay, that's understandable. You good? Ooh, gossip. You live by the police station, don't you? Did you hear anything? I heard some yelling, but nothing more. A total disappointment. Jeez, you need to pay more attention to stuff like that. How else are we supposed to get the juicy stories? Wee woo. Seems there's been an incident. You decide to head to school. Yeah, I mean, that's what we have to do. It's not much of a choice that we have. Uh oh. Hey, did you see it yesterday? We're in assembly or something. Of course not. What is that rumor like, for the real? The gymnasium. I don't know, but it seems like a lot of people have seen it. So much gossip around this place. I guess not a lot happens. So lunch. anything is something. I wonder why they're holding a school assembly in a small town a like this. Hey, what's wrong, Yosuke? Hmm? Oh, it's nothing. It's nothing. Everyone, please settle down. The school assembly is about to begin. Okay. First, the principal has something to say. And that is? Well, what you got to say? I regret to say that I have a terrible announcement for all of you. Oh? One of our third year students, Ms. Saki Konishi of class three. Oh no. Has passed away. Passed away? <sighs> Ms. Konishi was found deceased early this morning. Yeah, we, we saw that. Passing are currently under investigation by the police. But how did she even if get strung up there? That's the real I question. I you as students of this school to provide only the facts. Please quiet down. I have been assured by the faculty that there's been no evidence that bullying was involved in the incident. Oh, so mind what you say. You thought it was some like suicide or something? That's pretty elaborate for that to be it. Uh, looks like some type of killers in this town or something. She died the same way as that announcer, right? It's so creepy. Well, last time it was from an antenna, but this time she was hanging from a telephone pole. It's gotta be a serial murder case. Someone said the cause of death was some unknown poison. Unknown? Come on, this isn't some sci-fi drama. Oh, by the way, did you hear? Someone saw a girl that looked like Saki on that midnight channel thingy. They said she totally looked like she was in pain. Wait, they saw Isn't it too? Scary? I mean, I guess like if anyone nightmare. watched it, they did see it, so eh, maybe it's not that weird. Non-stop, so maybe they just had Saki on the brain. Because I mean, we saw Saki. Everyone else in our group Sheesh. saw Saki. It's so. easy to toss around theories if you're not personally involved. Yeah. Hey, did you guys check out the TV last night? Yeah. Yosuke, not you too. Just listen for a sec. Oh wait, last Something night. Something kept know. bothering me, so I watched it again, and I think the girl on the screen is Saki Senpai. Yeah, I I got Actually, that already. I'm it. Senpai looked like she was writhing in pain, and then she disappeared from the screen. 
What? You heard Senpai's body was found in a similar situation as that announcer's, right? Oh, remember that guy you told us about? How he was all excited that his soulmate was the announcer? Maybe, just maybe, but Ms. Yamano might have been on that midnight channel before she died too. What's that supposed to mean? Hold on. Being on the midnight channel, some like bad omen or something. Here on that TV, <gasps> die? I guess so. I can't say for sure. That's a theory. But something tells me. I just can't dismiss it as coincidence. <gasps> Plus, remember what that bear thing said? How that place was dangerous and we should leave before the fog clears? It also said that someone's been throwing people in there. Yeah, how? With the posters on the wall. We don't know it anyone with powers like us. Death. Well, I mean, powers that allow us to go into TV, there? that is. Couldn't that world in the TV have something to do with Senpai and the announcer's death? Well, what do you think? What do I think? Well, you might be right. So it's not just me, huh? Might be connected. If there is a connection, then it's a good bet that the two of them went inside that world. But how? That would explain the posters in that room. Which means, if we look around, we might find a place that has something to do with Senpai, too. Yosuke, don't tell me. You want us to go yeah. back? I'm thinking about going in again. I want to find out for myself. Um, D don't do this. That was you not a good idea the away, first time. I don't listen. think it's a good idea the second time. You think we can rely on the police? They haven't made any progress on the announcer's case. Besides, even if we told them about the world inside the TV, there's no way they're going to believe us. If I'm completely off base with this, that's fine. It's just... I need to know why Senpai had to die like this. Yosuke. After what I've seen and what I've put together, there's no way I can ignore it now. Sorry, but you're the only person who can help me. I'm gonna go get ready. I mean, I'm I'll the only person with the power to go inside TV, so I guess I'll help. Yosuke asked you to come, asked <laughs> us to take him into I the TV world. But I can't read. Feels, but we can't be sure we'll be able to get out safely again. What should we do? I don't know. Let's go. Let's just go with him. Are you serious? We can't let him do it alone. Might get hurt. Anyways, let's go to Juness. We can't leave Yosuke alone. Exactly. We gotta, we gotta go help him. He's our friend. Uh, sure. Oh, okay. I mean, it happens sometimes. That means that that must mean this part is gonna be a little long. I mean, this story, came. this game is very story heavy. But there's more to it than just story. Come there will be more later. Really just, just hold dangerous. on, just wait. We're getting know, to it. We were able to come back once, right? If we go in from the same location, maybe we'll meet that bear again. Okay. Maybe isn't good enough. Look, I can't just act like everyone else and pretend this has nothing to do with. Mm. That's true. I don't know why I keep but yawning. What about you? I yawned last time. Could you just walk away. It's not that this game's boring. It's just, honestly, like this. The story kind of is long, especially with the story. I can't work. Yeah, I thought not. I'm glad to know you're that kind of guy. Yeah, I'll help you. Don't worry, I'm not going in without a plan. Chie, I'm leaving you in charge of this. Oh, okay. Huh? What's That's that? an idea. A rope? We'll go in with this tied to me. That's so I not want a bad you to idea. Hold on to this and wait here. What? what? Then this is a lifeline? Come on, wait a sec. Here, this is for you. Oh, thank you. I got a golf club. I don't know how much damage that'll do to any enemies we meet, I but it might be better than going thank you. Ended. All right, let's go. There's no use wasting any more time. Okay, Gee, okay. Whatever you do, don't let go of the rope. Let's go into the TV world. Good job. You're doing your thing. Uh oh. Oh. Oh, that's not good. See? I knew this wasn't going to work. 
now it's okay. what? It's okay. We got that bear. We just gotta find him later. Hopefully. <sighs> oh, we're back here. Is this? Look, this is the same place as last time. Mm -hmm. So they are connected from place to place. You guys, why'd you come back? Um, we're a little curious about something that happened in the real world. I get it. You're the ones behind this. No. You're that thing from last time. Wait, what the hell did you just say? Lately, I can tell someone's been throwing people in here. It's making this world more and more messed up. And you assume we did it because we have the power to get here. in here? And I don't think anyone forced you in. Rude. That means you're the most suspicious. You're you suspicious. The ones the you're the only here. one that lives here. <laughs> don't label us like that. What are you talking about throwing people in? If someone was thrown in here and they couldn't get out, they might die. Who would do such a... Wait a sec. All this talk about someone throwing people in here. Does he mean Senpai and the announcer? Did that someone throw those two in here? I would assume hey. so. What do you think? <laughs> they accidentally fell in. No, no, that must be it. For sure. Yeah, I agree. I highly Let's doubt they fell in. He's telling the truth. Could it be that someone's throwing people in here intending to kill them? Probably. The but case, why? What are you guys mumbling about? For what reason? Why'd you come here anyway? What'd they do to you? It's a one-way door. You can't get out once you're in. Remember how I had to let you guys out? Yeah, whatever. We don't need your help this time. See? This time we have a life... Li yeah, no. What? Mm-mm. That thing's broken. Hey! You better let us out once we're done investigating here. I'm the one who wants to investigate. We can I've investigate together. Time, but it's never been noisy like this till now. Do you have proof? Prove to me you're not throwing people in here. Uh. Shut up. <laughs> See? So it is you guys. For the last time, it's not us. So we've got nothing to prove to you. Hey, you better answer our questions. This isn't like last time when we came by accident. We're dead serious. Listen up, because people have died in our world. Every time the fog appears, a dead body shows up with it. It has mm -hmm. to be related to this place somehow. If you know something, tell us. A dead body? Tell me, tell me, Whenever tell me, tell me something appears, I don't know. I know something I don't know. Something side. I don't know. The fog lifts here. It's really dangerous when the fog lifts. That's when the shadows get violent. The shadows. Ah, what are those? Get it. Huh? Well, if you get it, then explain it are to they us, like the it. monsters if in your closet when you're young? Side, you're like, oh my here. gosh. Shadows get There's violent? a creepy, That's why I said to hurry creepy back. figure it's in my closet. But in reality, it's okay, just no your clothes. I know you guys did or just you the black void right of a closet when it's dark. I told you and told you we're not the ones doing it. I forgot I had it with you. Why the hell won't you listen to what we're saying? I'm just saying you might be the culprits. No, we ain't. I'm just making sure. Mm -mm. Man, this bear's driving me nuts. Push him. This place anyways. He can't get up. Looks like he looks studio. round. Is something being filmed here? Hey, hey, don't tell me. Is that weird show being filmed here? Weird show? Filmed? What does that mean? Uh I'm asking if someone's been filming the people that get thrown in here. Eh? I don't get it. This world has always been like this. No one has ever done that filming thing here. What do you mean? Only me and shadows are here. I told you before. And what are those shadows? We don't know what these shadow things are. Or what you are either, for that matter. You keep telling us to prove our innocence, but you're the most suspicious thing here. Maybe you're yeah. the real culprit. And what's with that stupid costume? I'd oh. say it's time you showed your face. Yeah. Oh. Whoa. That's not okay. Who are you? It, it's empty inside. You good? Oh my. Me? Culprit? I wouldn't do such a thing. Are you okay? I just live here. 
I, just I love how you just peacefully. been ch you just chill about your head falling okay. off. Okay. I'll believe that you guys aren't the culprits, but I want you to find the real guy who did all this. You have to stop him. By us. Promise me. I mean, I guess or we're here, else. so why not? I'm not gonna let I mean, you we guys came here to here. look for some clues. So. You little. This can't keep going on. My home here will be a complete mess. And then, and then, I. <laughs> no, it's okay. We'll help what you. Are you. Crying for all of a sudden. Jeez, this thing's really weirding me out. Yeah. But like, he's so sad. Don't you feel bad? Hey, what should we do? Uh, you remember the words of the mysterious old man whom Nate called himself Igor? It seems you will encounter a misfortune at your destination, and a great mystery will be imposed upon you. Could this be the mystery that will be thrusted upon you? What was the contract or Igor spoke of? Could finding the culprit and solving the case be part of this promise? In any case, since you can't leave the TV world on your own, there seems to be no other option. You're the only ones I can ask. Will you promise me? Yes, we'll help you. I promise. Thank you! Damn bear. Practically holding a gun to our heads. But it's true that we came here to figure things out. Yeah, we can't be playing so the blame game here. In the dark. Look for the culprit, huh? Bring it on. You got my word, too. Might as well introduce ourselves. I'm Yosuke Hanamura, and this is my buddy. You got a name? Hey. How are you? Teddy. Oh. <laughs> Figures. But how are we supposed Teddy, to find the culprit like Teddy in the Bear. first place? I don't know. Oh, but I know where the last person came in. Oh? The last person? You mean Saki-senpai? I mm. mean the person who came in and disappeared last time. I don't know the name. Well, I'll take you there. You might find clues. Oh, okay. one thing first. You two should put these on. What are these? Oh, glasses. What are these glasses for? Oh, now we can see clearly now. I can see clearly now. The rain is Whoa, gone. The difference is like night and day. Or I guess the fog. With these on, it's like the fog doesn't exist. They'll help you walk through the fog. How do you well, casually have a pair I've of these been glasses? Here for a long time. So That's what I would like to know. How do you just ca uh, casually just ha have these you pairs? The you guys will have to You're just waiting yourselves. for somebody to just be like, hey, I want to help you. you. Maybe I'll monsters, make these pair of glasses understand? just in case weapons, but, I mean, somebody wants to help me. For show. Okay. We just got here. If it's so dangerous, why don't you do something instead of relying on us? Uh -uh. No way. I've got no muscles. Oh, oh, I'll give you guys moral support. Moral support? Distance. Wow, That's thanks. Sound. Much appreciated. <laughs> push him. I want to push him. Yeah. No. <laughs> is this thing for real? Uh, this is so lame. We swore to find the culprit, and this is all the backup we get. Oh yeah. Can I ask you something? What? Who's this Saki Senpai person? Someone you know? Yeah, just cost me. It doesn't matter right now. Anyways, at least now we know Senpai might have been thrown in here. Maybe we can find more information too. Let's get moving. Okay, let's go. Wait! Uh oh yeah, you. Okay. Oh. Okay. What is this place? It looks just like the shopping district. Yeah, but a little going on rusted. Here? Some weird places have appeared here recently. Things are getting so tangled. I, I don't know what to do. What is this? Uh, by the way, why like are you standing replica? so far from us? Like a you better not be planning to hightail it if something distortion? does come up. I don't know. <laughs> of course not. I mean, um, I can't stand too close, you know. I'd get in your way. <sighs> Man, they really went all out on this. But out of all the places in town, why'd they replicate this one? I don't know. How should I know? This is reality for the one who's here. As usual, nothing you say makes any sense. But if this is our shopping district, we're not far from Saki Senpai's. Then let's go. Enough sitting around. I knew it. 
This is the liquor store that Senpai's parents run. Okay. Does this mean Senpai disappeared here? What could Probably. Have Wait a second. They're here. Mm. What? Shadows. Ugh. I had a feeling oh my gosh. they were going to attack. I'm sorry. I just it's not that the game's boring, it's just it's long. It's a long game. It gets better. I promise. We're in tutorial land. We've been we've been in tutorial land for like the past hour. Oh. Enough complaining. We got fight we got shadows to fight. Oh. Hello. Oh, that's that voice in our head from earlier. The time has come. Open thine eyes and call forth what is within. Oh, we got a card. credit. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, intense battle music. We love that in a JRPG. And a cool thing to help us battle. Woohoo! Let's beat these things. Bam, 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 Stay calm bam. and listen. Some shadows have weaknesses. Mm. If you can pinpoint that weakness and take advantage of it, the battle will be a lot easier. Okay. I can tell this one has a weakness too. Oh. Try stuff out and see what works. Okay, I will. When you use an attack, if the enemy is down, but when you use an attack, the enemy is weak against, it will be knocked down. Compared to other attacks, attacking the enemy's weakness does more damage. If you can knock all enemies down, you get a one more attack. Use your weapons and skills to strike enemies' weaknesses and get one more attack to get the advantage in battle. However, if the enemy attacks your weakness, they will get an extra attack too. So always keep your enemy's weakness and your own in mind. Treat the malasic indices. Yep. No break away. This is like one of the many amazing tracks from this game. Have what on uh, which one's this? Uh, Reach Out to the Truth. Oh, love the song. Boom, 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 boom. Ooh, we got some XP. And Soul Drop, whatever that is. Ooh, I'm gonna level up to level two. Ooh. I guess that's our uh, persona. Nice. Y you, Narakami, has faced his other self. He's obtained the facade used to overcome life's hardship. The persona, Izanagi. Whoa, what was that? Did I um, hear you say persona? What was it? I mean, um, what did you do? Hey, I'm a superhero now. Yeah. Calm down, Yosuke. You're troubling Sensei. S sensei? Gosh almighty, you're amazing, Sensei. I am one impressed bear. I oh. can't believe you were hiding such an amazing power. No wonder the shadows were scared of you. Thank you. Are you the one who's able to bring people into this world? Um, sure. And that's what I thought. This is really something. Don't you think so, Yosuke? Dude, you call him sensei and then don't show me any respect? Sorry. Well, your support wasn't bad, though. I gotta give you some credit for that. Huh? Really? <laughs> Yeah, All right. okay, some you two keep helpful it up, and tips. I think we'll be fine from here on out. Now let's get back to the investigation. Okay. 
Let's go. Man, I wonder what could have happened to Senpai here. Mm, I don't know. Oh, what's that? I was hearing voices. Ugh, I wish Janess would go under. It's all because of that store. What the? Oh, I heard that Konishi-san's daughter is working there. What is oh this? My. How could she with her family's business suffering like it is? I heard their sales have gone downhill mm. because of Juness. Is this how people feel Stop it. about that poor father Zaki? to have his own daughter working for the enemy? Oh. What a troublesome child. Hey, hey, Ted. You said that this place is reality for those that are here, right? So, does that mean this was Senpai's reality when she wandered in here? I only know about what's over here. Yeah, I'm guessing people around this place do Whatever's not like Juness. We'll find out ourselves. You know, they like the simple things in life, which is understandable. Sometimes we don't need a big supermarket. We just need, you know, a cute little convenience Damn, store again. on the block. The man Sorry, yelling. How many times do I have to tell you? Is this Senpai's dad? I don't you know, know. You tell me. Say about you, right? Aren't you ashamed of yourself? You're the eldest daughter of a family who's owned this store for generations. Is it the money, or did you meet some guy there? Just tell me why you have to work there of all places. I, I can't believe this. She seemed like she had fun at work. She never said anything like this to me. You're telling me this was how Senpai really saw things? Okay. These photos. Hey. What photos? Is this... Can I see? It's the photo we took the other day with the other part timers at Juness. Oh. Why is it cut up like this? Scrap of the photo shows Saki Kanushi smiling. Can we see it, like up close? Yes, can be standing next to her. Never had the chance to say it. Is that oh, Senpai's voice. I always wanted to tell Hanachan. Huh? Me? That he was a real pain in the ass. Oof. I was nice to him just because he was the store manager's son. Oh, mm, that hits hard. He takes it completely mm -mm. the wrong way and gets all enthusiastic. What a dick. Oh my. In the ass? Girl does not like you. Who cares about Juness anyway? Mm -mm. Because of that store, our business is ruined. My parents hate me. The neighbors she talk hates my you. Back. I wish everything would just disappear. It's a lie. This can't be. Senpai's not like that. Mm. You never know. So sad. I feel so sorry for myself. Boo hoo. Oh. Who's that? Actually, I'm the one who thinks everything's a pain in the ass. <laughs> oh. Oh, maybe that's how he feels about huh? what she Toby like. Maybe that's what she thinks. Like what he you? thinks that I she thinks think about him. You know. <laughs> yeah, right. How long are you going to keep deluding yourself? Screw the shopping district and Juness too. You're sick of everything. Especially living out in the sticks. What are you saying? Th that's not true. I. You put on a good show of being carefree and happy go lucky because you're so terrified of being alone. The more, the merrier, right? You gotta be surrounded by people to block out the pain of isolation. Mm. And what's this about checking out this world for Saki Senpai's sake? Ha! I know the real reason you came snooping. Oh. Stop it! <laughs> Why so panicked? I thought I was just spouting bullshit. Or maybe I do know everything you're thinking. Why's that? Because I am you. Are you? You just came because you thought it sounded like a good time. What else is there to do out in this shithole? Oh. The world inside the TV. Now that's exciting. You didn't have a single other reason for coming here, did you? Is that true? Stop! Stop it! You're just trying to act like a big shot. If all went well, hey, maybe you could even be a hero! And that senpai you were so sweet on, her death was the perfect excuse. That's not true! What are you? 
Who are you? <laughs> I already told you. I'm you. Your shadow. There's nothing I don't know about you. Screw that. I don't know you. You can't be me, you son of a bitch! Wait, what's that one thing I was like, I don't know you. <laughs> That's right. Say it again. You're not me. You're nothing like me. Oh, what's happening? Yeah, that's right. I am me now. I'm not you anymore, see? Oh, what's that mean? Become a like a whole new personality, a whole new identity. Oh, you good? Oh my. It's a big frog. Big frog. Now now we gotta tame this big frog. I'm the shadow, the true self. Okay. I'm crush everything that bores me. I'ma crush Start you first. Uh-oh. Ow. Okay. How long can you survive this? This one's much stronger than the last type. Be careful. Uh, okay. Whenever you feel threatened, just defend yourself. Okay, got it. During battle, you can choose to defend yourself rather than attack the enemy. Select guard from the battle menu to decrease the damage you receive. While defending attacks to your weakness and status ailment of our attacks can be blocked. If it looks like the enemy is about to let loose with a devastating attack or about to hit your weakness, be sure to guard. But be careful or you'll be you will leave the defensive stance after being hit once. Got it. Okay, let's let's are you weak to Zio? Yeah. Okay. Uh what was this move do again? Oh oh that's not what I meant to do. Oh, 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 oh. Hold on. I need to figure out with the right button. Okay. Sorry, I'm playing with an Xbox controller, which I don't normally... I mean, I do normally use, but, like, uh... Yeah. This should be good. It's guarding its weak point! Uh... I guess I'll attack. Oh. Oh, 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 ah, 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 uh. Do I have... Okay, so... I did get some soul draw. What's, what's that? Hold on. <laughs> I gotta make sure I'm pressing the right buttons. Okay, let's use some medicine. We could use that. There we go. Let's use Zio. Since that seems to be the thing that I want. That's his neatness. Let's use it again. Yeah. That's not gonna work. Okay, so when it guards, Here we should guard. Defend yourself. Okay. Huh, that's it. Boring. Get out of my sight. Bada bing bada boom. We don't get hit by our weakness. And we can smack this thing to oblivion. Yeah. Brum brum. Brum brum. Brum brum. Brum brum. Brum brum. Uh oh. Uh oh. Mm -mm. Nope. 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 It's going to attack. Defend yourself. Stop hurting me. Okay. Um. Um, skill, Zio. Smack you. We're almost there. Halfway there. We got some soul drops, so it's not that big a deal. Oh, okay, we, we are. Okay. Okay. 
Ow. Uh, Zio. Just smack him. When in doubt, smack it out. No 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 Mm-hmm. It's going to attack! Defend yourself! Okay, okay. No, I can do this. I can do this. I believe. I believe. I believe. That's not gonna work! Uh here comes an attack! Defend sorry. yourself! What a freaking pain in the ass! Get out of my way! Out of uh, my way. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Uh, uh, all I can do is attack. So no, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Smart moves. Smart moves. Okay, let's do this. We got this. Got this. Come on. Smack it. Yeah. That's not gonna work. Uh. Oh, okay. Okay. We can do Here this. Oh my! This is rough. This is art mode, so I don't expect it to be easy. Okay. We're good. I think this is it. This should kill it. Yeah. We did it. That was that was that was rough. But we did it. I'm level three now. Yay. You good? I, I'm not. I, I mean, I know technically I am, Yosuke, but are you okay? I'm a little beat up. Yeah. What happened? I just beat up your shadow. That's what. You, you're not me. Don't say that. Came from you, you know what happened Yosuke? last time we did you did that you have to it didn't turn pretty it or it'll go berserk again exactly just accept it you have to be brave sometimes there's part of you that you don't like brave and sometimes it hurts to face yourself once you accept that you know there's something wrong with you you can learn to grow from lying. that I was so ashamed that I didn't want to admit it you're me, and I'm you. When you get down to it, all of this is me. Mm-hmm. Oh, the strength of the heart required to face oneself has made has been made manifest. Ooh. Hello. Yosuke has faced his other self. He has attained the facade used to overcome his life's hardship. The persona Jiraiya. This is my persona. Yeah, you can help me out. Oof. Yeah, but you're a little I heard tired. Senpai's voice. I wonder if that was something Senpai had been keeping deep down inside. Maybe. <laughs> he was a real pain in the ass. Huh. What a way to find out. Jeez, this is so embarrassing. It's okay. I'm right here. Oh, I'll help if you, you through here, this. I don't know what would have happened. Thanks. Anything. Anything for you. Hey, Teddy. Could Senpai have been attacked by her other self here? Like how it just happened to me? I think so. Oh. The shadows here were originally born from humans. Sometimes the fog clears. Then they all go berserk. And you saw what happens next. A strong-willed shadow draws others to it. And a big mass of shadows kills the host. So that's why people die when it gets foggy in our world. <sighs> Yosuke's pretty worn out. Yeah. This world isn't made for humans. It's not comfortable for you here. I don't Should we hear head any home? more voices. I think we're done with this place. 
Let's go back. Okay, let's go. Bye bye. Well, bye bye to that world. <laughs> hey Teddy, you said that this place is reality for people who enter, right? So that shopping district and the weird room we saw before, did they exist because the ones who died entered this world and it became their reality? I guess what I'm trying to ask is, did those places form because of the people who entered this world? I don't know. It's never happened before. But that's probably where they were when the shadows attacked them. This world killed them? The fog does lift here sometimes. The shadows get really violent then. Oh. I always get so scared I have to hide when it happens. Oh. I sensed people here twice before, but both of them disappeared after the fog lifted. Mm. So let's get this straight. Senpai and that Yamano lady were thrown in here, and since they couldn't get out, they wandered around. After a while, that shadow thing came out of them. The fog cleared, it went berserk, and it ended up killing them. Does that yep. sound right? So if I'd been here until the fog cleared, I would have been in much deeper trouble? Absolutely. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. You were lucky. Sensei and me were here with you. Damn it. Senpai and that announcer. We were stuck here all alone. No one could save them. Mm -mm. Yosuke, they disappeared when the fog lifted, but they were safe before that. No shadows attacked them. They attacked us, though. Maybe they're keeping a close eye on us. They might see people who investigate this place as enemies. It'll be dangerous, but we might be able to fight them. We might save people. Maybe. Are you saying if anyone else gets thrown in here, we can save them before they disappear? Like how you guys just saved me? Yeah, we, uh, yeah that seems to be the case. We could do that. Anyways, we need to catch the one who's throwing people in here and make him stop. But we don't know who. I'm finally starting to understand what's going on. Um, can I ask something too? What? If shadows are born from humans, what was Teddy born from? I don't know. You don't even know where you came from? How should we know? We barely know you. I know some things, mostly about this world, but I don't know anything about myself. That's for you to, to figure out. Honest, I never thought about it until now. Are you serious? No we can't really we help you figure out who you are. You. That that's a that's something you gotta figure out on your own. Will you guys come back here? Eh, sure, why not? Really? Well, you're the one who said you weren't letting us out unless we do. Oh, that's right. Okay, I'll let you out. But there's one thing. What? I'll be waiting for you guys here. Okay. You need to come in from the same place every time. So we can meet up. Okay. So like from the you TV? Could come in from somewhere else, but then you won't end up here. Oh. You might show up somewhere I couldn't get to you. Then you'd be doomed. You don't gotta put that it that way. Mm -mm. That's well, not nice. Pretty That's much. scary. All right. They can you show us the way Roger that. One exit coming right up. Yay. Thank you. Let's head home. We have, cool. we should probably explain to Che what's First going on. To make sure there aren't any employees milling around out there. How? She's gonna just shove us in there. Go go go! <laughs> Squish! Uh, hey, stop squeezing, you little! Ugh. Oh. And we back. I hope she's up. She is okay. I hope she's still there. Hope she didn't leave us. Oh, hey, girl. You guys came back. Yeah. Huh? We got some new powers with Whoa, it. What's with that face? Ow. Oh, the nerve of you guys. Oh, you're such morons. Oh, were you? Are you scared for us? You guys suck. Oh, it's okay. The rope got cut off. I had no idea what to do. I was so worried. Oh, it's okay. Everything's all right now. Scared stiff, damn it! I hate you both. 
I get it. You're you're mad. You're you're you have the right to be mad. I I think that might have kind of just just go blow off some steam. You'll Maybe be fine. Maybe we did go a little too far. Let's apologize to her tomorrow. Yeah, we should. I'm completely wiped out. I'm gonna go home, soak in the shower for a while, and get some sleep. Sounds like a great I idea. I'm gonna sleep well tonight. Well, see you in the morning. Bye. See you later. Near the floodplains while walking home for Juness. Oh, it's Yukiko. Mm -hmm. Hello. What are you doing here at this time of day? Oh, are you surprised to see me dressed this way? My parents sent me out on an errand. Oh. Um, are you getting used to your new town and school? Yeah. I like it here. Really? But it must be difficult moving to a place you know nothing about. I've never been out of Inaba, so I wouldn't know what it's like to transfer to a new school. Oh, are you getting along with Chie? I mean, I always leave early, so... Yeah, um... we're getting along, yeah. Yeah, we're getting along. I'm glad to hear that. Chie's very supportive, you know? It's always her who gives me the little extra push I need. We had homeroom together last year, too. And I still remember how we'd cut class sometimes. She seems oh, like a nice girl. I should get going. I need to make tomorrow's arrangements with our head chef. Okay, our goodbye. can't function without me right now. Oh. Um, yeah, you should go. I'll see you at school, then. Adios, then. Let's go back home. Oh. Dad's late. Oh. Hey, I wanted to know about that shampoo. There was some like shampoo or soap on the the TV. I want to see that advertisement. Saki Konishi was found dead in Inaba's residential area. Yeah. Since the body was positioned similarly to the last victim, and since Miss Konishi was the one who discovered that body, police are proceeding under the assumption that this may be a serial murder case related to the death of Mayumi Yamano. The coroner's report has established Miss Konishi's time of death at around 1 a.m. last night. The body went unnoticed mm. until this morning as a result of the heavy fog blanketing the area. Mm -hmm. Another incident. Dad yep. won't be coming home tonight. Nope. Are you worried about him? Uh-huh. But that's how it goes. He's a detective, so he's really busy. It's okay, I'll be here. If you need me. Amagi Inn, located upstream of Samegawa River, is the town's oldest historical landmark. Vacationers are known to travel surprising distances in order to visit its open-air, radium-rich hot springs. After the incident with Miss Yamano, the manager has stepped aside, leaving her daughter Yukiko to fill her shoes. Oh. Yuki calls on TV. Words, she's a manager who's still in high school. Now that has a nice ring to it. Let's see if we can interview her. Excuse me. Hmm. Um. Are you speaking to me? We've heard that you're the new manager. Is it true you're still in high school? Oh well, I'm only filling in temporarily. Someday though. That aside, wow, you're looking gorgeous in that kimono. You must have had a lot of male visitors. Huh? No, um... This is boring. Yeah. Can we oh, turn it to something else? I need to do the dishes. Oh, okay. I can help. If you need me. You decided to help out with housework. Yeah, I want to help. You can now check your status by pressing the command menu button. You can now create quick save data from the command me the command menu Woohoo! to continue playing from a quick save select continue from the title screen and the layout and progress of the current floor will be reset and you will start at the beginning of the floor what <laughs> um i think that's referring to something that we haven't gotten to yet but okay it gets a lot faster when there are two people washing the dishes it sure does well i think that's it for this video we sure did a lot today, figuring out um, what happened to Saki Kanishi and getting two personas.
But yeah, that'll be all for this video. If you like this video, please comment, like, and subscribe, and stay tuned for more Persona 4 Golden. And I'll see you all later. Goodbye!